beautiful day for a Reds game today, but Monday the Reds played in front of the smallest crowd in 21 seasons at Great American Ballpark. Also a cold day. Yeah, a little day. chilly that day. Reporter Taylor Nimmo has been digging into what it means, though, for the team moving forward. There is nothing like walking through Great American Ballpark. The sun is shining. You can smell the hot dogs cooking, hearing that crack of the bat. But then you finally get to your seats and you look around and recently you may notice there's a lot of open seats. Attendance at today's game was 10,205. That may sound low, but it's an improvement from Monday night's game. The attendance was 7,375. That's an all-time low for the ballpark. Seven-week-old Sam Hausler went to his first ever Reds game today. Sam's dad and older brothers say they'll be back. Win or lose, yes. We make it down, what, two or three times a year. When they believe the crowds will pick up? Between the weather and winning. Say so more fans will come when they start winning, I think. He does. Early in the year, a lot of frustration with the fans. School's not out. And fans say they need to win. Hopefully, if they play a little better, the crowd will come. Look at the Bengals. The Bengals were very exciting this year, and the crowd showed up. It's a different experience when there's a packed crowd. It makes the game a lot more fun when people show up to the games. Sports management professor and Reds fan Brandon Wright says it's possible there's a connection between how easily fans can access games on TV. Trying to get your outlet on streaming is of the utmost importance to any sports league. Uh, you look at the infrastructure for the NFL, for the uh, NBA, uh, your average younger consumer probably has not watched too many Reds games unless they're actually at the ballpark. Wright says a Attendance is down overall for Major League Baseball right now. So to see lower numbers uh, is not necessarily all that surprising. Uh, but this early in the season, where literally, you know, you're 20 games into the season pretty much, uh, that kind of apathy it does set off uh, a couple of alarms. Now you're early in the season, things can absolutely turn around. Reporting from Great American Ballpark, Taylor Nimmo, WCPO 9 News.